Fabs, uh, thanks for, for uh, making the interview. Um, given the fact that we've uh, it's been a while now. those midweek away games that make a difference but overall, yeah, we're, quite, we're quite happy with how it's gone. What was the most challenging game you've had so far? Um, the ones that stick out were uh, the semi-final was, was a real tough game, more so because you know we wanted to get a final for the, for the club, you know we don't take it for granted that it's not been easy to get to club going again so you know it's something to look forward to now so in, in a way that was a cup final, that was tough, uh, the Cody Cup game was a real tough game. Sides. So you know, you know, Broxbourne were a good side. You know, beat us really well. You know, I think they'll do well if they don't cut this year. I think they'll do well next season. So yeah, I think them three really stick out. You've played in a couple of games. Do you see things differently on the pitch? Yeah, you do. You you see the, the little things. I think more. Uh, you know, the, the, the games that I've played. You know, sometimes. Yeah, you do certainly see a few, few things that you don't see on the sideline, but it works both ways. You know, there's things that you see on the sideline that you don't necessarily see when you're playing. So it's you know, it's, it's you know, you get out of it what you can. And, and how's the morale in the camp, Jenny? That for us is, is great, and for us it's a big thing with morale and team bond and everyone together. We don't want any idiots on the side. So that is like real. Couple of uh, people come in and people go. Um, do, do you miss? Have you missed any players that have gone? That, you know, we're realistic and we're honest, and that's going to happen. You know, we want to keep people here. We're not struggling to sign players. We want to keep players that we've got here. But you know, I've been there where you're not getting picked, and you have to make a choice. You've got to say to yourself, "Am I going to fight for my place? I'm going to go look somewhere else." And I can't say anything about someone that wants to go and play regular football. There's one or two we've missed, you know, there's one or two we haven't missed, but we're happy where we are at the moment, you know, with the squad we've got, we're real happy. And the morale in the camp hasn't changed because of it? No, no, you know, we've got a couple of characters in the side, you know, the captain, Ferg, Mort, you know, LaSalle, they don't let people get to above their station. So, yeah, you know, everyone's, you know, nobody, there's no clicks, nobody just talks to the same person one week, you know, and that's it. You know, so the morale is no problem. As, and just something slightly related, what about the style of play? I mean, obviously when the morale is good, play is generally good, but what, what were your thoughts on the style of play? Uh, one thing that I have found here is, this, uh, you know, we've come from a really, what you can say is a non-league, proper non-league pitch to a pitch that is unbelievable, the services, you know, I think it's the future of non-league football. And you think it's going to be easy and it's not that easy. It's not that simple just to say, yeah, get the ball down and play. You have to learn the pitch on certain days it's slow, on other days it's quick. So I think at first we were maybe forced, forcing it a little bit, forcing to play, forcing maybe when we could have gone a little bit more direct because we're on a great surface. I think we've come to grips to it now a little bit more, you know, we've proved that we can play. But you know, we're in non-league football, so sometimes you know you might have to go a little bit more direct. I think it's horses for courses. I know that's a cliche, but Tuesday night away on a not so great pitch, yet yeah, you might have to play percentages and put the ball in the channels. You know, when you're on a nice surface, not just ours, there's a couple of other nice pitches in, in the league. Yeah, maybe you can take a few more risks playing out from the back, but we certainly do want to play as much football as the pitch does. I've, I've got to say, I've, I've been to uh, all the games, and uh, yeah, absolutely right. I think there's, uh, the football that's been played has been played for the course, if you like, yeah. and, it's, and it's been good. Um, so, are you looking forward to next season? What, what does next season hold? We are. We can't wait. We don't want a break. We don't want pre-season. We want the first league game. Um, I'm, I'm hearing loads of things about us. So the Tuesday night away game, like I've said, 
where the two best players are missing. I think that's where the league is won. So we have to improve on stuff like that. We maybe have a left field player in a way different to where we play at home. But we are really looking forward to next season. This is why we come here. This is a project. You know, we want to get the club promoted, but we're not taking it for granted. We're not favourites. We don't see ourselves as favourites. We don't think we're just going to turn up and win. We know we had that when we were at Cop Foster. We went up for the first season in the last time. Thanks for your time, mate. Thank you very much.